All right. I've got four attendees listed on the meeting notes, and it looks like I'm still missing four people on the call. If uh, you can find time to add yourself to attendees, that would be greatly appreciated. I think we have all familiar faces, but as always, if we have anyone new on the call and you are able to speak up and introduce yourself and let us know you're here, we'd like to welcome you and hear how Kubert is um, in use in your world. course, if anyone is using Kubert and their use case is not on the, the adopters list, consider opening a PR so that the community can see how you guys how you guys are using it in your world as well. That would be great. Welcome, Miguel. All right. Um, the agenda is partially filled out. Thank you, Andrew. Uh, if anyone else has anything to add to agenda notes, open floor, PRs, or bugs that they specifically want called out, or if you have anything on the mailing list that you specifically want to um, get extra visibility on, feel free to drop that. If you don't have edit access to the Kubert community meeting, you can join the mailing list, the Google group, uh, at, uh, and that should give you access. Otherwise, feel free to drop a comment in meeting chat, and we will be happy to help you get your item on the agenda. All right. And with that, it looks like we are opening the SIG storage meeting next Monday. Um, Andrew, do you want to add anything to that? Uh, nope. If you're interested, uh, the link is there. It goes to the thread. Everything, hopefully, all the relevant information is included there. And uh, yeah, please let me know if I've missed anything. Um, but it, the, the only tricky thing is it'll be a fortnightly meeting. Um, and so it'll, it might get a bit wibbly wobbly when we hit in the um, like December shutdown time. But apart from that, it it should be pretty regular, hopefully. Cool. And I dropped the link to that in the Slack chat, uh, not Slack, the Zoom chat as well. All right. And then Boston, do you want to say anything about that or open in for a summit? Nope. Uh, the few people have reached out um, to get some help with their submissions. Uh, so I know we've got a couple of people who are going, who aim for FOSDEM. Um, yeah, that closes in, I think, a week I think, from memory the 10th. It's on that, it's on that thing anyway. Um, yeah, uh, the more the merrier with that one, with both of them. Of course. Awesome. All right. In that case, it uh, looks like we have an open floor item. Cooper, client, go. Do you, you want to speak to that? Yeah, sure. Hi, can you hear me? Um, yeah, you're really, really quiet, though. If you can speak louder or turn up your mic volume, that would help. My mic is all the way up. All right. Is we'll just ask. Better? Yes, that is better. Cool. My question is, I'm using the Kubert uh, Client Go package or model in a different project, and I'm using the VMI for um, like a conformance test it's called the VM Agency Checkup. And there is no context to the methods of uh, VMI, and I want to cancel them. So my question is, if I try to um change it on Qbert Qbert. What is the procedure to do it without breaking the API for everyone? Wonder if we have anyone on here that can answer that one easily, or if that's something for the mailing list or the 
Slack channels on Convert Slack. Okay, I'm going to recommend carrying that one to um, Kubernetes Dev probably on the Kubernetes Slack, if that's okay. And then if that doesn't work, uh, the um, mailing list is a reasonable place to try. All right. Let's see. So unless there's anything else adding to agenda or open floor, I'm going to jump into PRs and bump scrub. Uh, yeah, so this is um, on oh, the community repo. Um, this was this came up last week, the, the old calendar link or wrong calendar. Yeah. Uh, it's got an LTDM and an approve. I would I would have thought it would have gone through the merge. So it maybe needs another approve. Um, the label hasn't come up, but uh, yeah, I just thought it here in case someone here has the uh, power to click the go button. Cool. Well, um, let's. Ah. Why is my clicking? Failing miserably. I need coffee. All right. Needs approved label. Cool. Guess I don't need that. Is that actually something I can do? I don't think I'm an approver. I can't do that. All right, well, worst case scenario, I'm definitely going to make sure that's on next week's, but I guess I have to make a template for that first. I, um, Chad is not on the call, but I can see him looking at this document, so I might just ping him now. Okay. Either way, we won't mess up next week. May I have a question? I somehow mm -hmm. can't access uh, the event on Google Calendar about the storage meeting. Mm -hmm. Next Monday, it seems does not existing yet. Oh, um, the, in the calendar link in the email thread? Yeah, just clicking here and I can access it. Actually, I can't see it in there. I see the calendar, but yeah, it looks like the event is missing. Hmm. Um, is anyone else able to I, see that? It does. It just takes me to um, a, a general week in the calendar. It doesn't have an event on it. Yeah, it is just a it is just the Qbert calendar for the yeah. next week. Um, okay. At, on yours, it'll be very early in the morning because I think it's eight a.m. East Coast time. So that's what okay. five a.m. West Coast. So if you just go, no, it's not there. All right, thank you. I will. Uh, I'll look into that. Thanks for letting me know. Cool. Thank you. All right, and. Scene. Make sure we get that distributed out next week as well. All right. Um, clean up module dependencies. I'm on one. Is it too early for sarcasm? Sorry. Let's see. 
got some reviewers attached. I am going to presume this one is still moving forward. Let's not get hung up on that one um, as it's good for maintainers and the reviewers are there. Uh, why did I do that? All right. Add create VM command. That's kind of cool. If anyone's going to want to add reviews to this one, it looks like it's moving forward. All right, let's go ahead and jump to mailing list. New APIs for delegation of privileged operations. Well, it looks like it's aiming to reduce privileges further. All right, and then the proposal is to write new libvirt APIs. Cool. Um, definitely looks like a conversation worth uh, adding to. Does anyone have any opinions on this? First thoughts, um, ideas to bounce off each other on the call this morning? Caveats. All right, well, definitely looks like something worth adding to. If you can jump into the mailing list and provide feedback or bounce ideas off of others and bring that back, that would be great. All right, then let's jump to bugs. CTL SCP from Windows. 
Um, does that work if you set up SSH on your Windows node? Does Windows play nice with the forward slash instead of the backslash? But it worked when using port CTL, port forward, and SCP. I am in the unfortunate position of having the Windows VM to be able to test this on now. Actually, I'm sorry. I am the community meeting host. I should not say such things. I am in the fortunate position of having a Windows VM where I can test this. I'm going to go ahead and probably give that a try later this afternoon. All right. Let's see. Field PVC not found. Use code formatting. Is there any, um, yeah, this name in spec of a tall machine? Where does it take from? The best visibility we have into that is right here. Could you just uh, run Control F to check, uh, double check that name is correct? Oh, no. If you if you check the command which lists the PVCs is specifying the another nine space. I think oh really that, that's why it fails. And CSI and then this is what namespace is the VNM? And, and the other name machine other name is, is in Cow as VMI. Ah, good call. All right.
All right. Good eyes, by the way. Let's see. Dedicated CPU placement, not usable when set within an instance. We, we can skip this one. He's already okay. at the end. Cool. Awesome. And in that case, that concludes the agenda for this week. Anyone have fun facts, neat ideas, or other interesting tidbits to share? You'll have to be interesting people. I know that you are. OK. Well, um, going once then, going twice. And that concludes our weekly community meeting. Thank you for your participation. Um, we'll see you same time, same place next week. Thank you, Gap. Thank you, Omai. Thanks, Gap. Thanks, folks. Bye -bye.